What's going on guys? Killer6 back with another Borderlands 3 video for you and this time we're taking a look at another new feature that's been added into the game. Photo mode! That's right. No longer do you need to like drop all your guns or put all your guns in your backpack to try and get a really cool picture. Now you can just enter photo mode, move the camera around, get low angle shots of your character or high angle shots, up close shots. You can even do this, if you're playing solo, you can even do this during like boss fights to get a good picture of a boss and things like that. Great for, you know, screensavers, backgrounds, thumbnails if you do YouTube videos or anything like that. Just a really awesome feature, something that I'm glad that they uh, incorporated into this game. And uh, boom, just like that, photo saved. That's all there is to it. Real simple, real easy and uh you can get some really cool pictures by doing this this one's just a short sweet video talking about it oh you know what I'll, I'll show you some of the features of it though so check this out you can change your field of view which is really nice um obviously maxing that out gives you the widest view of the uh, surrounding area um camera roll i don't oh okay so you can actually change the, like the the angle of your picture that's pretty cool I hadn't even thought about something like that. Whoa, you can go upside down? <laughs> That's neat. That's pretty neat. I like that. Uh, you can reset the camera with a push of a button. Oh, <laughs> what the heck did I just do? <laughs> okay, there we go. All right, we're back to normal. Um, <laughs> so we'll put that at zero. Uh, you also have focus distance. Um, I'm not real knowledgeable with cameras, so I don't know what all these things do, but... Uh, Okay, so you can choose, you know, what's in focus and what's not in focus, I guess. Uh, I'm terrible with like camera settings, so I don't really know what any of those things do. Uh, you can adjust contrast, saturation, brightness. Obviously, these things will change uh, the, the, the way the picture will look, obviously. You can uh, always hide the settings just by, um, I'm using controller on PC, make fun of me all you want, uh, but I just toggle that by pressing R3, which is the melee button generally. So uh, whatever your melee button is, probably M. Hold on, actually, if I do this, it'll tell us, uh, yeah, it's actually H, H to toggle the UI. So that way you can see that. Um, then this one, I love, this one's really cool. Now, if I was out and about changing the time of the day, would affect the the colors of the area around me so that's pretty cool you can also choose to hide your character how cool is that man so like you want to get a picture of something but like oh crap my character's in the background and he's holding like you know a weapon that i don't want anybody to see or whatever i could hide my character very neat very neat uh you can also do things like adding a film grain i oh that's pretty cool so you can make it look old timey or whatever uh, you even have different filters you can put on your pictures if you wanted to have some fun with that. Oh, these are these are hilariously awesome. Uh, you can add vignettes. So like uh, vignette basically means that you're gonna add like a uh, like a, a darkened uh, border around it. It's hard to explain that one. Uh, you can even choose how much feathering is on that vignette. So yeah really cool features guys i love the photo mode i hope you guys do too this is something that we didn't even know that we wanted or needed yet again they're delivering us more stuff than we ever knew that we wanted or needed so if this video was helpful or interesting to you guys if it was please take a second hit that like button hit subscribe for more tap the bell icon to be notified anytime i post a new video appreciate you guys watching and i will see you guys in the next one take care